My name is Juliette Eve and I'm a face painter. I've been painting about 20 years or so. Uh, so I'm here at Paradise Wildlife Park today to show you how to paint some popular faces. Uh, right, today I'm going to show you how to do some Halloween eye makeup. Um, I'm going to incorporate a bit of a spider's web in it as well. Um, I'm painting Carla and start in the corner of the eye, blend it up and out. And again on the other side, do the same kind of thing. Starting, as I say, this is the, the darker green and then I'll use the lighter green. It's also a metallic, it's, it's also called um, bronze, but uh, it's more like a sort of verdigris colour perhaps. But it does blend rather nicely with it. So I'll blend that in with the other green. The two together, rather beautiful. I'm going to um, use a little bit of black, not very much. Again, I've got two blacks. One is quite highly pigmented and the other one less so. So I've got a bit of black and I've just dipped it in the green as well. So it's not just black, but it's going to be a greeny black. And I'll go, I'll go into the corner. This is where I want it to be darker. Fine a line as you can, so it's a matter of using the tip of the brush or a very fine brush, whichever you find easier to use. And finishing off the line to make it very, very thin. And I'm going to do an eye line, keep your eyes closed, Carla, until that's dry. And then as most of the paint is now off the brush, now is a good time to do the connecting webs. So incredibly lightly, very, very thinly, if you can, do the connecting webs. And it doesn't matter if they don't actually reach the other side like that one didn't, because that adds a kind of light and dark depth to it. Just, as I say, just connecting webs like that. And I just want to put some highlights on this. So I'm going to go along the top of some of the webs, not all of them. This is a gold, um, it's a glitter gel. Um, and glitter, the advantage is it dries quite quickly, but always test a little bit on the back of your hand make sure it's flowing freely and always make sure you clear the nozzles after, well after every day, every day's usage really. So this is quite a bright gold. Um, now I'm going to highlight the spider so he stands out a bit and then just highlight a few of the webs. I think that's about it really. So, there we are, that's how to do Halloween makeup, um, spidery style, okay, complete with a spider.